Carol Fletcher, fondly remembering her horse and our inductee into the 2021 AMHA Show Horse Hall of Fame, French Market, said he was ahead of his time in English pleasure and pleasure driving. He loved to show, loved the crowd. He thought the crowd was cheering for him only. The more they cheered, the more he grew. He thought he was the best and only horse in the ring. Until the day he died, he thought he could go to the Grand Nationals and win. French Market, known around town as Max, was bred by Sarah Lynn Farm. The handsome bay gelding was by Trout Buck Hallmark and out of Greenmead Sunshine. His arrival in June of 1986 was the start of a long and beautiful life of 35 years, with a show career that spanned 22 of those years. Max attended his first Grand National in 1987 as a yearling and grew into an English pleasure and pleasure driving champion, finding success with amateurs, ladies, and junior exhibitors alike. Along the way, he trained and exhibited with Bonnie Sogoloff, Joni Tuttle Barham, Peggy Alderman, Forrest Nealon, Dick Bocher, and Ginger Mullendore. In 1999, he joined the Fletcher family and remained with them the rest of his life. Max had a lot of presence, and he was a force. Max was all go all the time. He was very serious about it, and it was all show horse all the way, said Carol. Max was not only a presence in the show ring, he was a presence at home too, demanding that everyone adhere to his streak feeding schedule and turnout schedule. He knew what he wanted, and when and let you know if you were not performing to his level, and how Max loved the snow. Up until the winter before he passed, he would go play in the snow, like a big dog. And then there were his birthday parties. Guests would gather on the patio as soon as he arrived, and he saw them waiting there just for him. He would grow about 10 inches and just pose and pose. Many adults and kids came to see Max, and he graciously introduced them to the Morgan breed. A lot of his visitors showed other breeds and asked to ride Max. They all said the same thing, wow. And... This was when Max was already in his 20s and up. He always sent the kids home with an AMHA activities book and great memories. What a breed ambassador.